Hi guys, this is Rampant FM and today we to continue our Ken Beef Let's Play. We have a Scottish Cup game against Gretna 2008. You'll see the morale is a bit low, unfortunately. We have been quite inconsistent in the league. Um, also, we're out of all the cup competitions apart from the Scottish Cup, so we're really looking to see how far we can get in these competitions. We're probably looking at one of the bigger teams in the next round if we can get through. I have changed the lineup a wee bit. Um, some of the, I don't want to say B sort of players, but certainly players that don't uh, normally get a game I've started today, because I feel that we can, with our squad depth, we could probably beat Gretna. So I'm taking a big risk in considering our uh, form, our inconsistent form. I think I've just been impatient with the game, really. I'm, I'm looking at dynamics, and I don't fully understand them yet. I think I can prove, improve them just by getting results and obviously training so I'll stick with that now also just a side note I'm sorry for not uploading recently I know it's been a week since my last upload I have been busy obviously with the Christmas period working I have also been ill again um, I think this is three or four times in the space of two months or something uh, that I've been ill so that's never good so yeah we're taking the game sort of to Gretna Gretna are also kind of dangerous as well They are. we are the away team I'm looking to make maybe a change or two. Yeah, he's injured, so I think. Yeah, we'll get him off. So yeah, I'm sorry about the lack of uploads. I will be uploading a couple of episodes of this before I'm back to work on Monday. And we'll continue our FIFA series as well. I'm, I'm not finished with that, obviously. I've just been really busy, unfortunately, um, in life as sometimes happens but I've managed to record a few episodes of this starting with this one so yeah I appreciate everyone that subbed to me recently even though I've not been uploading that there has been a, a, a couple of people um, so I really do appreciate it as always so we're looking at going into half time now now which isn't great we really need a win here just to improve morale I'll probably change the team up a wee bit So yeah, as I say, I think I've just been a bit impatient uh, with this. I'm expecting results right away because of the, considering the sort of golfing class between the players, but it just doesn't always work like that. So we are going to make a few changes. We'll bring Rodden on. We'll put him to target man. And we'll see, we'll see who else we can put on here. So yeah, the save the save's going all right. I, I, I'm kind of losing. I was losing a wee bit of hope with it because of all the issues, but I think I'm getting a, a grasp of dynamics. I've read a couple of blogs and uh, someone I can't remember the guy's name left a comment uh, describing it in great detail what everything goes into team cohesion and whatnot, and it was really well explained in a thorough explanation. So I have took that on board and looked at different things. So hopefully we can win this game and really assert ourselves in the league. We have only lost that one game against Clyde in the league. Obviously we're out of the comp uh, cup competitions, which was disappointing, but realistically we have met our objectives in the cups. We just had to really be, uh, well basically provide a challenge, which we did. Especially that 2-0 win over Dundee at the beginning of the season. So I'm going to change formation here, just to go a bit more to attacking. Just to try and get that, that goal or two that we need. What can we do? Yeah, we'll, we'll go with this. This is our sort of secondary formation. I have used it a couple of times. It's not always worked out, but I feel we need to really push Gretna. Just to, to see how we'll go. I've noticed um, some of the guys are getting a bit more adapt to the positions they're playing, which is great. As young footballers, obviously, that's always a thing where they need to be trained into certain positions and where you want them to play. So it's good that they've got a bit of adaptability. I have, I'm also on a training course, I think a coaching course, where I'm like going after my Continental C license, I believe. 
so that'll help help us out with the training as well. We do have good coaches. We did add a few good ones, uh, like Brian McClure to to help us out with the youth aspects. I've also asked the board to build uh, better youth facilities, which they're doing, so that's always great. Uh, other things like uh, affiliate clubs and stuff, they're not really ready for. I've also asked for them to buy the stadium, which I think they're going to do as well, so that's always quite good to have that early on. The more, I was expecting to build a new one, because um, Central Park is actually pretty old. So I was hoping that they'd build a new one, but they weren't for that. They wanted to just buy the new stadium, so we don't have to pay rent money anymore when that gets purchased. I think it's next year, so that's good. We'll go to counter. We don't seem to be doing much, and they are attacking us quite a lot. We're just going to demand more here. We do seem like we're dominating a wee bit. Gretna have had their chances. That's why I'm going to go to counter. We're away from home. And that is a goal. And I think it's Zach Rudden. So, yeah, we've got the goal. Switch to counter. Away from home. Good ball in. Zach Rudden's there. 1 0. And hopefully that will seal it quite late into the game. It did take us a while. was longer than expected unfortunately I was expecting to be kind of up before, well before then and it's 2 now. yep Johnny Mitchell makes it to this should see the game off hopefully right at the end of the game it's a win, we're through in the Scottish Cup It'll be interesting to see who we get Hopefully one of the bigger teams for a challenge. And that's it. I'm quite happy with the result. It took us a while to get into it, but we did change the formation up. So that's it, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. We'll come back for Montrose, I believe. I think we skipped them in one of the, the earlier episodes. But they are still doing well. So we'll come back for that game. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you soon. Yeah.